Hello, and welcome to the stream. I got a question for you. What are these? I got these with my Chinese food today. And I couldn't tell if they were napkins or food. And they smelled kind of like flour, so I was 80% sure they were food. But that 20%, I was worried about. I didn't want to eat any napkins. I asked around and uh, we, I think we came to the conclusion that they were spring roll wrappers. Which not I nor anyone else had ever heard of just getting spring roll wrappers with their Chinese food. And I didn't, it didn't come with any napkins either, so. Maybe they mixed them up. Which is a scary thought. What are their, what does that mean for their spring rolls? I'm doing another Majora All Rupee Randomizer stream. Jack was not in the, uh, not in the condition to do any streaming today, so he's going to take the day off, and I'll do this. And depending on what we get, I may just be able to finish this today. I know, I say that every time, and I jinx myself every time. I probably shouldn't have said it. But... What we what we need now... Is... The Zora Mask... And all the arrows. A couple songs... Wow, we're, we, okay, we are still missing a lot of stuff, actually. Sorry, enjoy the intro while I... Get my little tracker thingy up. Forgot to do that before the stream. masks, no remains. We have not cleared a single temple. What temples do we have the means to clear? Do we have... We still only have the basic arrows, is the problem. We need all of these for all of the temples. We need the Zora mask still. We haven't found that. We can't do Woodfall because we don't have the Deku song. And we don't have the Zora song either. We can't even use this to access uh, Stone Tower without the Zora Mask because we need all of the statues in order to make the climb. However, we did end the previous stream by getting the Garo's Mask. So, we now have access to Ikana Canyon, which is a bunch of things. Uh, I gotta check there. I gotta check some places around the Great Bay that I didn't really explore. So those are the main things that I'm thinking that I want to check out. Uh, there's some more snowballs, I think, that we didn't check in the snowhead area. Let me take a quick gl uh, quick glimpse at what those are. I think we missed some day one snowballs. Twin Islands day one snowballs, that's it. Oh, also... The Goron Racetrack, I think we can access, even though we don't have the ability to defeat Goat yet. But we can still blow our way onto the track, and I think there are still the pots scattered about, which is what all the items would be. I don't think it's the magic pots, I think it's other pots. Hello, Darian. Okay, so what do I need to do? I should start this run, this cycle, by getting the Gwei stuff.
I guess in some ways that Gwei is kind of lucky. It, it just gives me a bunch of stuff that is good to have for the current cycle. Oh, there you are. Oh, you're drawing a durian. I see. Hello, Microlink. Oh, okay, that was magic jar. I don't need that. What I want is the Chateau Romani. And the red potion, that's what I need. There we go. Oh, what a nice bird. I'm sorry I said anything mean about that bird. He's so helpful. With this, uh... Did I actually save the... The witch? I don't remember if I gave her the red potion or not. Yeah, I did. Okay, so I should give this to the, the guard. It does drop an item. Yes, it drops like uh, 20... It's like, like, like 23 items. Wait, no, I don't have the lens of truth. I can't give it to the guard. Maybe I was... Uh, maybe I jumped the gun a little bit on that red potion. However, I have my chateau and I have some rupees. So, I can buy a powder keg. Hello, Durexello. This is the game that famously had the Ben Creepypasta written about it, yes. Well, it was a game before it was a Creepypasta. It's a very good game. And is also creepy in its own regards. Honestly, the creepy pasta probably ruined it a little bit for a lot of people. I was pretty involved in the creepy pasta community for a while, though. Not because of this game, un unrelated to this game. And I liked the ones that were game-related. Usually involving, like, uh, glitches and theories about what might have been lore in the games. Like, the Link is Dead theory is something I would have enjoyed as a child. But not something like, there was a ghost of a kid who died and haunts this game cartridge. That, the real-life kind of stuff. Those kind of tie-ins I always found kind of silly. like Pokemon creepypastas I love because the Gen 1 and 2 games. Gen 1 in particular just felt like it was held together by duct tape. It seemed like anything could have happened in that game. There could be any weird, creepy, secret, hidden thing inside it. Alright, day one snowballs and uh, Goron Racetrack is a bunch of stuff. I really hope we get something uh, something we need there. Hello, Tox. Again, for those of you who are not here for the previous streams, this is the All Rupee Randomizer. Every non-RNG drop in the game is in the item pool. Which is like a thousand rupee locations that I now have to keep track of. It is masochism. You know what's even bigger masochism? The Wind Waker randomizer. Boy, that's a big game world. 
I wonder what a Breath of the Wild randomizer would be like. How crazy could that be? That has to be pretty bad, right? Because Breath of the Wild is pretty big. What if you scrambled in all the Korok puzzles? You could have a necessary item between, uh, behind any of the, like, 900-something Koroks in the game. Aren't there that many? Okay, here we go. Goron Racetrack. It's so nice and peaceful here. I kind of- it's- it's a winter wonderland! Listen to the happy music! I have the grace track all to myself! <laughs> Maybe it is these pots. Oh my god, they randomized the Goron Racetrack magic pots. Oh, there's so many of these. What, is, what does the tracker say? How many of these are there? It's like 20-something? We're on racetrack. Uh, uh oh, it's 30 items are on this racetrack. One, two, three, four. Five, six. Okay. Uh, I don't need that, so I want to get rid of it, actually. What is this music? Is this Mario Galaxy? Give me the Zora mask. Give me some arrows. Give me a song. Once we have fire arrows, we have all we need to do the uh, Snowhead Temple that we did a portion of last time. Okay. Pizza Heart. Pizza Heart. This is vandalism. I've broken into the racetrack after hours, and I'm and, and I'm, I'm robbing from the pit stop. Is what I'm doing. Oh yes, this is Wink. It is White Link. He gains his power from milk, and all of his magic is white. Rupees. 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 Okay, that's a new hat. That's an item. Postman's hat. A new mask. Okay, stone tower compass. What are you? Stray fairy. Rupees? I have gray rupee. Once I achieve maximum rupee, I need the 500 wallet. Then I will have white rupee. Pretty much everything in the HUD is customable, customizable in this randomizer, which is pretty neat. It doesn't have the text scrambler that uh, the Ocarina randomizer has. Although, as obtuse as this game can be sometimes, that maybe that's for the best. Not, not having to try to decipher NPC dialogue that's scrambled. Okay, I think there's one more set of jars. Pictograph box. That's some items. I can use that. Okay. There was nothing super amazing in the Goron Race track, but we did get some useful items. We got the postman's hat and the pictograph box, which lead to some other things. Ow. 
I don't think I ever visited the Akana Canyon. No, I haven't. I haven't been to the business scrub up there. I wonder who he's selling. Being an artisan in the Zelda universe must be the most thankless job in the world. You spend all day making these nice clay pots for people to store things in, just for some some butthole kid to come in and break every single one. Alright, snowballs. These are all going to be new items, because I haven't been here on day one yet. Peace. He is hard. Five. I forget. Talks. Have you played Ocarina? Ocarina of Time. Blast! Water Temple will be hard. Depends on how much of it I need to do. Maybe I'll have everything by the time I get to Great Bay. Maybe I won't need to, like, hunt for items in there. Maybe I can just go straight to the end. I already cleaned out most of the mountain temple. Alright, snowballs, nothing amazing. I got a piece of heart, that's it. What else did we talk about? Econa Canyon. Still no song of soaring either. We gotta walk everywhere roll everywhere. Horse, come to me. Have it on GameCube and can't play it anymore. I is the disc like screwed up? It was the Master Quest stuff on the uh, GameCube version. That I never, uh, I, I had never played until I got Master Quest versions of the dungeons in the randomizer. Can I check in here? I don't know if I had the Goron last time I was here.
Those are unforgiving, the uh, Master Quest dungeons in Ocarina. Come on! Okay, I'm invincible as long as I'm mounting the horse. There's also a bunch of, like, uh... There's spider stuff I could check. There's stuff at the at the farm that I could do. Where am I going? I need to... Uh... I'll take a look around the canyon, and then if I have time, I'll go to the farm. Gotta get another powder keg for that. rock being. Alright, what's my Akana checklist look like? Path to Akana Grotto, I just checked that. Green Rupee, awesome. What are you selling? You got a sweet green rupee across the way, I see. Arrows. No, I don't need ten arrows for a hundred rupees. I'm good, thanks. Oh, I can't- I still can't enter the canyon. I don't have ice arrows. Dang it! Well, I could do a portion of the Waterfall Cave, and I think there is a way that you can actually do the canyon. You can access the canyon unintentionally by hookshotting from a very specific place. But I know the randomizer is not going to demand that of me, so I, I'll just I'll, I'll wait until I have the ice arrows. There's a grotto in here. I need to get some bottled bugs and check the uh, bug spots around the place, because those are all items. God, everything's an item. Big chest, big chest. Yes. And stray fairy. I bet there are bugs in here. Give me bugs. Aha! I'll do another cycle if I need to get the, uh... I need to get the uh, red potion for the, the soldier. If I remember correctly, fish turn into fairies. What does water turn into? I don't remember. I can't do this without the light arrows. Rupee grass? Rupees are nuts. Oh, hello. 
What are what are you? Is that a blue rupee? I think that's just a blue rupee. Skull tokens. That's a lot of stuff. A lot of worthless stuff. Boy, I'm glad I looked up. It's just a bunch of rupees and sculptula tokens. So this uh, this is not worth hurrying to. Just rupees. Secret Shrine Soft Soil. Skull Sanity. Uh, this is basically maximum settings. Everything in the game is in the pool. Kana Canyon Grass. Can I get at that? Or not yet? There's nothing else back here, is there? I don't think I can get at anything in the canyon until I have ice arrows. I think all of these spots are up on the cliff. Need those skulls? Maybe. There is a very, very small chance that an important item could be a spider house reward. I would have to get beans, and I need to find out what bottled item turns into water. Because I accidentally included the bottled items in the randomizer pool. Let me do a quick double check that there's no grass or anything around here. I think it's all up top. I think I found the I found the ocean title deed, so if I wanted to get this guy's thing I could, but it's just a green rupee over there, is all it is. Sorry, I know there's a lot of stopping and starting. Haven't I bottled yet? I haven't bottled a Deku Princess. I haven't bottled a Zora Egg or a Po or Hot Spring Water. Honestly, it's more likely I'll get the Song of Storms before I have a reliable source of uh, bottled water to use on on beans. Where's my horse? That's my horse. Let's go to the ranch. I can check the post box in town, now that I have the postman's hat. That's one item. I'm gonna have to be very gradually checking off bug spots as I go all over Termina, spreading my bugs. Sculptural token. Do the four gossip stones. That's a whole lot of effort for low return. Let's see. 
pillar soft soil. Let's commit another crime. Actually, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna deposit first. I got 200 rupees. There's still one more bank item we haven't got at a thousand. Take one. I'm gonna blow lots of stuff up today. We're close. Fifty more. having issues watching on Twitch on Twatch. You don't like watching on Twatch? It's Twitter for Twats. Oh, on mobile. Postman's hat. Still haven't checked the final day chest. Might as well get some beans while I'm here. Is this the beans one? I know there's beans in here. There we go. I was going to go to the... Well, there's stuff I could do at the observatory. But I want to be sure I have time to do the ramp stuff, so... I can get some stuff with. Goron roll is really cool. It is. It's a shame this is the only about the only Zelda game you get to play as other races in. This game has a lot of great movement, especially for an N64 game. You get to roll around as the Goron, you get to swim fast as the Zora. Any game that lets you swim fast is great. Spyro. You don't like my name, Wink? Ah, yes. The Mafioso Aliens. Very scary. Romani Ranch. I didn't do the Gorman Brothers race. Again, trying to avoid the tedious stuff if I can. It's starting to look like I can't, though.
Oh, I missed one. Damn it. Horse, please. Two more. Where are they at? Here they at. That might be the best I ever did at that. Okay, heart container. Nice, but not important. That was Romani's game. What else do we have? We have the doggy racetrack. I need more bugs. Y'all got any bugs? Need like a grotto or something to find bugs in. Somewhere dank that bugs would, would be. Oh, hello. You're an item. Hi. Look too busy to talk? Yes. Let me sing you the song of cows. I don't know which ranch cow this is. Wait, no, hello. You're supposed to give me milk from that. Is it because it's already being milked? I don't think I can milk this cow. What about the other cows? They're all out to pasture. Darn. Maybe at night, they'll all be there. Just got- I gotta get some bugs. Give me your whole bugs. Oh, there's no grass in here. Nancy because the, uh, the... Weirdly enough, this particular spot's bug rewards change between days. Oh, I saw some. Gimme him. Gimme! Alright, got some bugs. What are you? What do you use for streaming? I use OBS. Just plain old OBS. OBS.
rupees. Ever heard it called OBS before? That's what I usually hear people call it as. I think uh, Streamlabs OBS is a little bit more popular, but uh, I don't like how I, I, in my experience, that version is more resource intensive. So I just have the most, I have the basic OBS. If I need uh, Streamlabs features, I, I handle handle those on the on the website for it. All right, doggy racetrack. How late are you open? It's a gambling place. It's got to be open late. There's soft soil, and there's a roof thing here. Hello, moon. Good night, moon. See you later, Link. Okay, bomb shoes. Where's the soft soil? Here it is. What precious little time left we have for bugs. Give me something good. Give me the Zora mask. Green rupee. Why do I ever expect anything else? Just soft soil. Ranch day one soil. I believe the ranch soil is behind the house for some reason. Yeah, they just got a hole in the back of their house that I can put bugs into. Like a jerk. Butthole wink. I'm so sorry for starting that. It's a green rupee. I wonder what, what, what an arbitrary choice that that item is different. Day one or two or three. Are the cows in yet? Cows are not in yet. I gotta check the cows. Those are all items. Even the cows are randomized. Cow number one. Let me play you my bells. I think there's bugs in the stockpot in kitchen. There are, now that you mention it. Oh, that doesn't reflect well on them. Yeah. I'm predicting two more green rupees. Jar, as if to spite me, I'm predict I am predicting a green rupee or a magic jar. I will be satisfied with either of these items. I hate this place.
Well, we're here, so we might as well do the Romani stuff. I just gotta have good timing. With my set very quiet, very roommate friendly drums. It is unfortunately the only way that we have to uh, quickly skip time in the randomizer is to use the sun song. I'm glad there's only one premier reward. There's a slightly different cutscene if you do this whole string of quests twice. But it looks like that's not two slots in the randomizer, which is great, because that would suck. Goron Sephiroth waits. Where is she? Two o'clock? There she is. Hey, I'm just a friendly strange Goron. Oh, she recognizes me. It was just a map of Romani Ranch. Hey, what are you talking about? Look weird to you? Look, that's what the ranch looks like. Oh no! The Mafia aliens are here! I'll do this without slowing down time. I'm confident. I just want the morning to arrive faster. The less time we have to spend here, the better. I wonder what this track is from. I don't recognize it. Okay, they're getting a little close. Maybe I should, uh... Oh, it's from Breath of the Wild, okay. Time Lord Link slows down the Mafia aliens before they can reach the barn. The map makes them look a lot closer than they really are. Oh, 
Oh yeah, by the way, there are just just aliens in this Zelda game. Not ghosts, not orcs or magic specters, just just aliens. Here to abduct cows and probe people. Don't think about it too much. If you don't do this quest, then the little girl does actually get abducted. And if you show up on like a later day, like day two or three, she's just, she's all messed up in the head. This is a very dark game at times. Apparently there's a way to cheese this. Like this. Apparently if you do this over and over again, the aliens don't get a chance to advance, but time still very slowly passes. And you can do that until morning. I've never done that, nor do I ever plan to, because that sounds incredibly tedious. But it's an optional setting if you want to include in the logic that you might have to do this without a bow and arrow. Now we break the I already broke the crate. I'm gonna run out of arrows soon. Everyone knows sunlight is the natural enemy of aliens. Much like vampires. I guess that's it. What else is vulnerable to sunlight? Zombies? Well, Minecraft zombies. Five AM, is that our threshold? I thought it was like 4.30 this stopped. Vampire aliens leave this place. That's a strafe. I mean, it's not... It's not a difficult challenge if you have time slowed. I don't worry too much about missing arrows. Who cares? Who cares?
I would like a ride into Clock Town. Thank you. Now, I could go and do a bunch of other stuff in the meanwhile. But, if I do that, I know I'm gonna forget about this, so... I'll just do this. This will be the ranch cycle. I will get some more bugs. Why do you need so many bugs? Well, because there are so many holes in Termina. I need to check every bug hole. I've been neglecting my bug holes. Now that it's day two, the one at the ranch has a different thing in it. Uh, ranch day two or three soil. You know what? I will. I will go do something else. I since I have the spare bug. Let's do the observatory stuff that I've been neglecting. Oh, hello, horse. Still here. Let's see if I remember the code without checking. We got a pretty easy one. Oh yeah, the music is scrambled too, so... Uh, not getting the traditional Majora experience. I think that was, uh, someone said that was Koopa Beach or something from Mario Kart 64. There are. We have to put bugs in all the Cheez-Its. All over Termina. There's so many Cheez-Its to check. checked all these, didn't I? I must have come down here. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes. Darian is watching YouTube. The YouTube comment, the YouTube chat is not appearing on stream at the moment. So, I can see it, but the stream will not. I hear y'all got Cheez-Its! Where the Cheez-Its at? Got some fine Cheez-Its. Yeah, I am planning to wear the Gorman mask on the uh, wagon ride. Magic jar. All right. Sorry, I want to keep up with my checklist, otherwise I, I know I'm going to forget one of these thousands of things. We didn't do Treasure Chest Game Goron yet. I don't think. Did we? I, I don't remember. Oh, Stockpot Inn, there's some stuff that I could do. A couple easy items in there. Termina Field. Uh... 
observatory soft soil. And there's two other things I can do with the observatory. I wish to look through your telescope, old man. I wish to be mooned by a skull child. Literally. Alright, one more time. Let's see who, who we can uh, voyeur on. We gotta watch this guy. That's right, you carry those bags. Oh, they, they shortened his route for the randomizer. They made it nice and quick. And also... There you are. Yeah, fly those mountains. This is apparently a special bird. This is not just scenery. This is an item drop. It's just rupees, too. Well, imagine in the main game. Like, this could be a good item. Imagine in the main game going through the trouble of watching this stupid bird just for rupees. Uh, it's ten arrows. Or it's a, a, some arrows. Not an important item. You go home, stupid arrow bird. Did you discover anything interesting? What a shameless old man. But he seems nice. He seems like the, this friendly old dude who's befriended the bombers, the, the neighborhood rapscallions, but he's just he's just he's just a voyeur. He's just watching people all day. Basically, he's Master Roshi, is what I'm saying. This is not an entry. But it looks like something that should be. I'm kind of surprised that's not a rupee drop. Alright. Telescope Gwei is ten arrows. Yes, yes. I cracked your code. Give me a, a heart. Sorry, magic jar. Oh, I actually have the bomber's notebook this time, though. So why did that trigger if I have the notebook? I, st I don't think I got the room key. I don't think I talked to Anju at the right time. Maybe I did. Uh... Okay. So one of the... Okay, I'm gonna have to look this up. One of the entries is, uh... The masks. But I cannot shoot arrows or use my weapons in here. So what... How, how do I get the masks? What? 
use the Zora barrier and backflip near the mask. Did they? That can't be intentional. So they put something you would have to shoot to get a rupee drop in a place that you cannot use arrows. So the only way to get it is to use the Zora magic shield. Bomb mask? I don't think that can work because that's a B button command. No, I can't explode in here. So, I th that seems like an oversight. That seems like an unintentional remnant that remains in the game. Day two. It's raining. Anju is at the laundry pool. Sobbing. Oh, she's not. Did I miss her? Hello, magic jar. Maybe she hasn't come out yet. Alright, let's check the, uh... How many rupees do I need? There's a very magic jar. It flies and everything. Let me get some rupees, because I'm gonna need some for the uh, scrub purchase. I think I need a hundred. I think that the rain would be, like, super effective against him, or something. Oh, horse. What a good horse. Found you. Ooh, bugs. I'll sell you a blue rupee. Just 150 rupees for five rupees. Hmm, you drive a hard bargain. How about a hundred rupees for five rupees? No. Dick. Money launderer. Let's see, south wall. Oh, there's there's the arrows. Great. This must be the south wall hole. One rupee. Let me play catch up on some of these. Business scrub purchase. Blue rupee. Uh, I haven't done the gossip stones yet. South wall soft soil. One rupee. Stump soft soil. Stump soft soil. Is there a soft soil on a stump? Or just near a stump? Ah, oh, but it's this one that I already got. I just didn't check it. Yeah. Let's see, swamp archery, boat archery. Can't do anything in the cleared swamp yet. Pictograph contest. Yep. 
It's day two, so I think the contest is over, but I believe I can still turn in the picture of Tingle. The father's shame will not have vanished. Tingle, smile! There's also a fix to the uh, slow pictograph thing that happens with emulating Majora's Mask. That's something the randomizer addressed. Maybe it lasts until the swamp is cleared. Maybe that's the end of the, uh, of the contest. Oh, it wasn't a good enough picture of Tingle. So there's three... There's three things for the pictograph contest. It says there's standard photo, good photo, and winner. I know Tingle is winner. Let's see if he likes the owl statue. That's a nice picture of a statue. Hey. What do you think of this? Kind of a standard shot. Five rupees. Or another boat cruise. Oh, well that's not five rupees. Oh, I can get all of them in one cycle. That's great. This is three items then. Alright, standard photo. What would be a good photo? Maybe... The wildlife of the air. Brilliant. <laughs> Pretty sure others have taken pictographs before. All right. No stray fairy. All right. You force my hand. That's a good picture. That's a perfect tingle. It's my son! Oh, blimey! You know my secret. Have some arrows. Dude, the, the standard prize was better. This contest is rigged. Uh, what else can we do? On tourist center roof. Can we see what's up there? Green Rupee. Check that off. Not worth going for. Bean Grotto. Bean Grotto Soft Soil. That's another thing I would need bugs for. I got bugs. I do have bugs. I don't want to go all the way to the green, the Bean Grotto, though. 
I'll bet there's other closer soft soil. Hold on. I just... A thought occurs. I should drown. That's my thought. It's day two. It's raining. Can I grow beans without needing the Song of Storms or the bottled water? I'll bet I can just access the palace on day two like this. Life hacks. Wait for rain. want to be a Goron. I could. I could walk through this water, but I'd take damage. I said I wasn't going to do other stuff before Creamia, and then I did exactly that, so don't let me forget about Creamia at 6 p.m. Okay. Bugs and beans. Beans and bugs. Deku Palace Soft Soil. The rupee? Come on, grow. Yeah! Day two! Life hacks! Get up. Idiot. Okay, there's actually one thing I need to check before I do this. There's an entry called Deku Palace Out of Bounds Item. I need to know what that is. Deku Palace. If you play with casual logic, you can ignore this chest. Wow, well, it is exactly what it sounds like. There is an item that just floats out of the accessible boundaries of the world that you would need, like, uh... You would need glitches to access. I guess because I have it set to casual logic, it is just not included in the pool. Yeah, it's just a green rupee. I just, I checked the box. Well, thank God for that. Why is this the only place in the game that there's an out-of-bounds item? Why is it the only one that they would include in the pool? Magic jar, blue ruby. I've already been here, I've already got all the lower items, but I was not able to, uh... I was not able to grow the bean and progress previously. Hello, Arrow Gamer. No, I looked at those earlier, and you cannot use your bow 
inside the Stockpot Inn, nor the Blast Mask, nor any bee items. The only way that you can apparently get those is by using Zora Magic, and I do not yet have the Zora Mask. And then we have one more item from the moon. You have bow. I do have bow. The things I am still missing are the Zora mask, the three magic arrows, and a few of the songs. was a tremendous waste of time. What else have we got? We do this. No, we can't do the smithy because we need fire arrows to, uh. There's a snowball I missed in the mountain village. There was a day one snowball that I haven't checked. Well, let's uh, let's go uh, let's go do Creamia. Look at me! Look at what I, look at what I can do! This could have been in the base game. This wouldn't have been a problem, would have been game-breaking. I wonder why there's different clear items. There's some slots that, uh... Some spots that are different at the Witch's Hut after the swamp is cleared. Despite the Witch's Hut never being subject to the poison. Also go deposit rupees. I think we might have enough for the the bank prize now. What do you got for me? Thanks. Great. It's just like a real bank. Worthless interest. 0.01%. I guess I could have checked the bean grotto while I was there. Oh well. It doesn't rain in there, so I would still have to go back there at least one more time. Still haven't sold everything to the curiosity shop.
I wonder why this guy was chosen to be the one to go clear the road. Maybe he's in trouble with the boss. Maybe the head carpenter doesn't like him. Uh, I did all the racetrack stuff. I could race the Gormans, except I just threw away all my... I deposited all my rupees. Do I have any bugs left? Oh, I used all my bugs! One sec. here? No, it's just this particular cow just hangs out here. I did do the cow grotto. Nope, this cow just will not give you milk. You can't play a song to remind her of the pasture because she's already on the pasture and grazing. I guess that does make sense. to get some rupees. Maybe I need the Gilded Sword to have the maximum sword radius. Was well, actually not that many rupees. down. I think that's arrows. Is that chest there? Here, could this be rupees? Rupee. Great. I did find, like, a, a really good source of rupees at one point, and I just don't remember what it, what it is. I also have a bunch in the bank that I'm just being too lazy to go to. I'll raise the Gorman some other time, if I need to. I can do that at any time. needed those bugs. But to check the day two farm hole. I don't know why it's different from day one to two. 
Come on, Zora Mask. Wait, did I already do this? Oh, I think I already did this. I checked day two already. Darn. Well, that was a waste of bugs. mask. I don't think I've done the dancers yet. It's going to be uh going to be a busy night. We're going to do Creamia and we're going to do the dancers. Yes, I'm ready. Oh, y yes, I understand Kepora Gebora. Oh no, this music? Take what you want. My sadness will never go away. What poor unkempt horses. Once again, I'll provide context. Normally, they would be attacking you, and you would have to fend them off with arrows. However, if you have the circus leader's mask, the mask of their sad brother, they cannot bring themselves to attack you. They just don't have the heart. Mini game. Oh, what's the item? I got the item fanfare. What was the item? Or was that just the victory fanfare? Okay, great. Thanks. Arrows. I would have rather had the hug. I can't help Camaro because I don't have the uh, Song of Healing. However, I do have the Camaro's Mask. Whoop, oh, wrong mask. I completely forgot that I would not have access to most of Ikana without the Ice Arrows. Alright, ladies, get a load of this. Nothing. It was a blue rupee. What else can we do? It's night two, so we can't save the old lady. We're really running low on stuff. Easily accessible stuff, anyway. Ah. Uh, well, we still haven't done the final day chest. I gotta do that, because I keep forgetting. We 
do the treasure chest Goron game. Tomorrow when that's open. Rosa's sisters. Do I have the bunny hood? I do. I forgot that I had that. Postman, are you in? Ah. What time does he do his his thing? I haven't I haven't spoken to the postman since I got the bomber's notebook. I haven't bought this yet. I might as well. We should have had the larger bomb bag, but there was an accident. I was hoping that would add the old lady to my notebook, but apparently it does not. She's too traumatized to speak of the incident. What bottle items do I have? I have a bug. I don't want to sell my bug, but I could. Can I sell the seahorse? Hmm. I have a devious idea. I can always get more bugs. Now get water. You should be able to bottle this, Link. It's clean water. Man, really? I gotta go out of town for water? What's the point of those pools? I think fish turn into fairies. Let's go fishing. Weird bottle mechanics. Oh, I'm sorry, that's a big po. I didn't want that! Man! Can I get rid of it? I'd have to sell it too. And I've, I've already sold a big po, so. That was a wasted trip. What I want to do is I want to get the different uh, curiosity shop things. Because I haven't done those yet. Wait, why was it a horn for a second? Is it because I'm wearing a mask? Whoops. It just broke. Why is it? It's just a horn now. Alright. I got a ghost. I got a seahorse. High quality stuff. Yeah, 200 rupees. You can't sell it's it's so valuable though. You can't sell the seahorse? What you really can't get rid of that thing once you have it. Granted, you're not supposed to have it until you have the uh until you have the Zora mask. Alright. So that's the red rupee reward is a blue rupee. You bought if he spends if he'll pay 20... He'll pay 20 for a bug. It must just be water that he'll spend, He'll pay like five, five rupees for. There's a five rupee sell thing. What else can I bottle? It's the... Purple rupee 
is red. So it says I can't get that yet. It says I can get the blue rupee, though. What bottle items do I have? I have bugs, I have mushrooms. I, I do have fairy. I guess that's what I could sell. But no, he can't pay that little for a fairy. Maybe a fish? Why would he pay less for bugs than for a fish? Or, or less for a fish than for bugs? This man confuses me. Let's go to the swamp. I know there's spring water there. I missed my chance to do the the day two bats in the graveyard. That's another thing I could still do. Again. Song of Soaring would be great. Wondering where that's at. This whole town's socioeconomic situation is a giant mindfuck. It's like that town in uh, in Adventure Time where everyone's a thief. I think that was also a book. There was a novel about a society in which everyone was allowed to to steal a certain amount of things or something. I don't remember the details. All right, I got a fairy for you. Surely you want this. It's going to be 20 rupees. For a fairy! A fairy is equal in value to a fucking bug! <laughs> okay. It must be the fish that he'll pay five for. Because I don't have bottled water yet. The mushroom? Maybe the mushroom? I, do, I can't think immediately of where I would find a fairy to bottle to get a mushroom, because that's, that's what fairies turn into, is mushrooms. I guess I just won't worry about that yet. Let me do the day three chest. Honey and Darling is two items. Archery, I've been avoiding. Gossip stones I could still do. got to be it's got to be one of these things is a progression item I don't know why it says that I can do the bean grotto even though I do not have the ability to grow the beans necessary to reach it. oh you know what it's because it's a treasure chest I can hook shot up to it that's why it says I can do the bean grotto if hook shotting this is a, this is a stretch this is a small chest isn't it no, it's not. What are you? It's a skull shell token. All right. There's that snowball, day one snowball that I didn't get. Oh, there's been a lot of disappointed voice in this run. Foreman Brothers race. 
Great Bay. Great Bay, that's where I was gonna go. I'll bet there's stuff there that would be uh, worth looking at. Why did I didn't need to do that? Why did I do that? I want to talk to the postman. I wonder where he's at. I need to know when I can play his game for an item. Let me check the Goron shop. Let me see if I can catch the postman. And, uh, I'll go back and I'll check Great Bay. I can't even get rupees from these anymore. Uh, I can get a rupee. You know what I can get rupees from? Sorry, gotta be arrows. I forgot. But where'd you go? Oh, you bastards! They got stuck up there. I, I didn't need them anyway. I get one shot at this. It's a small chest, so it's nothing. I already know it's nothing. I'm just a simple poker dealer. But I know what kind of music they folks like to hear when they're gambling. We like our customers to be nice and relaxed. Because relaxed people spend lots more money on gambling. All or nothing! Oh, get it, get in the front! Yeah, that was worth it. <laughs> no. You're a scam artist. Every game, this is a gambling town where every game is rigged. You pay 20 or 30 rupees for everything and the prize is one rupee if you win. pitter-patter of postman feet. Oh, it's not 9 a.m. yet. He hasn't even started yet. Eve, that's horns too. Hold on, everything's horns. My drums are horns, the the the, the horns are horns? Wait, are the horns horns? We put horns in your horns. It is. What what happened? Sleepy postman. Look at he. Look at he sleep. With his eyes open, I think. What a strange fellow. What is his game? Postman. Okay. Afternoon of day one and day two.
let's go back in time and let's check out Great Bay. Let's see if we can fix our ocarina. are back. I am not gonna... Well, hmm. I should follow the Gwei for the, 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 the Romani, the Chateau Romani, but nothing else. I'm gonna avoid the other stuff, because I don't want that stupid seahorse before I need it. It's just taking up inventory space. Hello, bird. Where are you? You're a fickle bird. You give me one good thing and you give me one paperweight. I think it's always going clockwise. Is it not? Oh, there it is. That's right. Is this Clocktown Festival is the Feast of Fools? Everything is topsy turvy. Man, I got greedy. I thought, look at all the nice things. I want to pick up all of them. I thought the seahorse was a little further down the line. There's a free rupee. Infinite Magic, and Great Bay. Oh, uh... I guess I should get that Day 1 Snowball, too, while it is Day 1. Come on, get up, Link. You know what? Forget this. I'm gonna have to roll up the mountain anyway. Can't bring my horse up. Can I bring my horse up there? That just occurred to me. I don't think I've ever tried to bring a Pona up the... Well, no, you run into a cliff part way where you need bombs, so... Even if you could bring her up this slope... Which I don't know if you can or not... Horses don't do well in snow. Even if I got her to this map, this would be as far as she could go. one snowball. I just gotta check all the big snowballs around here. This could be anything. It's a spider. Booty blast. Booty blast.
Nothing. Fill up on arrows. Oh! I, sh I wanted to bottle that, darn it! What? I can still get that fairy. I just gotta remember to sell it. Well, no, I know... Okay, it's not gonna be a fairy when I bottle it, that's right. It's gonna turn into... a fish. Sorry, a mushroom. Was that it? Was it that was the day one snowball was a green rupee? Quite a few items here that I can get once uh, spring arrives. Yeah, green rupee. Twin Islands, day one. Okay, so that's all the day one stuff. There all the snowhead stuff I can do. Alright, Great Bay. that music is. Oh, it's a Twilight Princess track? I wonder how many tracks are in the randomizer. Again, I know the uh, Discord for the randomizer has a request thread where you can submit MIDI songs for the uh, randomizer inclusion. They know better than to spawn with Goron rolling. To the ocean, where we can only slightly swim. You forgot to turn on the music option in the Twilight Princess rando. Does it include tracks from other games, or does it just scramble the native music? Oh no, please. Alright. We did not do enough exploring on this map, so let's do that. I should have got beans. I'll bet that because... I wonder if it rains here on day two. these. Skull a token. And a heart. Ledge pot one, two, and three. I'll bet the heart was not randomized. If it rains here on day two, then I would be able to grow the bean and access more of this. Y'all got any pots? 
rock. And free bug. There's a pot. One rupee. Is that all of them? Are there more pots? Oh. Well, I don't know which of these are the randomized ones. Okay. Cafe's mask. Doesn't do much, but it's a new mask. Seagulls hanging out. What do you have to say, Gossip Stone? Or for Omani's nighttime? Okay, that doesn't. I don't think the 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 hints were updated. They're all native hints. There's a pot, there's a pot up there too. There's lots of ledge stuff here. What is this? Is this the Twilight the Twilight Princess field music? Got the Zelda theme in there. Oh. Green rupee. Raise Oh, hey, better sword. That's something. Not vital, but very nice to have. There's a grotto just here. I thought we needed to, like, access... Great Bay Coast Pot. Oh, there's the ledge pots, and then there's Great Bay Coast Pot 1 through 7. I thought we needed a bean sprout to access this grotto. Oh, it's Breath of the Wild, says Darien. Magic jar, and you are gonna have a green rupee. I think there's a strip of land far to the right where you get thrown out. That's what I thought. Maybe I didn't go far enough. Bottle of red potion. Is, oh, is that a new bottle? That's a new bottle. All right, we now have four bottles. I don't know how much that sells for. Probably not much. still need. The same things I needed at the start of the stream. I still need the arrows, the songs, and the Zora mask are the big things impeding my progress. Anything else is a nice bonus, but is not necessary. Also, the Fierce Deity mask would, uh... It would be nice to get that during this run, because that would make the Majora fight a lot easier. Oh, Darien. That's another thing that this randomizer fixes. It uh, removes the thing that the game does that we experienced last time, where if you get the Fierce Deity, it locks you out of using the transformation masks. Randomizer undoes that. There's not any pots up there, are there? I think I've gotten all of the Great Bay pots. A lot of green rupees. Lab fi 
fish. Which I would need to fight a big Poe again. Uh, no, that was not a bug. That was a thing in the base game that the randomizer fixed. The randomizer makes a lot of uh, quality of life improvements to the game. Basically, in order... The Fierce Deity Mask in this game is your reward for getting all of the other masks. It's your 100% reward. And it makes the final boss fight a joke. It's extremely overpowered. And if you do get it, then they want you to use it. So they disable any other masks you have if you have the Fierce Deity Mask. Like, you have to use it to fight the final boss if you have it. No, it is not necessary. The heart and soul of this game is the side quests, though, so... Really, the, the only way to get a, a complete experience is to get all the masks. In my opinion. What am I here for? I'm here for beans. It's nice to have a bean source. As long as they don't get stuck up there. I guess I could do Honey and Darling as well. Like, I might as well. It's a little time-consuming, but it's, it's not as bad as other things in this game. Welcome back to Gambling Country. The only station that plays in Clock Town for everything about gambling. What am I doing? I'm doing another Clock Town game that is sure to have an extremely unfair prize for winning. I have a problem. Is always the small chance. That's how they get you. That's the gambling. <laughs> Alright, what's your day one prize? One rupee. I should- why did I- yeah, yeah. So, there's a prize you get for beating- they have a different minigame on each of the three days. There's one prize for beating just one of them, and there's a bigger prize for beating all three days. I got beans, that's what I came for. Race the Gorman brothers. Let me double check that I did get Anju's item for the, the room key slot. Stockpot in. Midnight meeting is an item. We could do that. I did do the inn reservation, and surprise, it was one rupee. No, go in! Link! An NPC used the door and stopped me from pressing the open command. Okay, you know what? I, I, I still have time anyway. She's still at the desk. 
All right, 11.30. At the inn. Treasure chest game Goron. Wow, I'm looking at the list. Treasure chest game Deku, green rupee. Goron, green rupee. Human, green rupee. I wonder what Zora's gonna be. first night. I could save the old lady to do that. Zora be the one to have the Song of Awakening in it? Oh, the, the treasure chest game. I see you, you scumbag. You won't get away with it on my watch. I am Gotham. Sorry, Clock Town. It is quite a size increase when you get the final sword. Let's see, a midnight is when we can do this. I'll spend the rest of the time going through my little lists here. What are we doing? Uh... I'm gonna go back to Great Bay on day two when it rains, when I can plant my bean. We're doing Honey and Darling. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. I almost forgot I have my meeting with Anju. I'll bet I can do both. Anju arrives in the kitchen at midnight. I don't know how long she stays there. And these really do happen at exactly the same time, don't they? I'm already here, though. I found the room key somewhere. I don't remember where I found it. I'll have to double check some items that I've already gotten for uh, other things I can do with them. I haven't checked the guest room chest. I don't think. a more realistic pace for an old woman carrying a heavy bag to be walking at. Hello. Lovely night. You talk? I'm sorry. Sorry, cop. What's he sorry about? That's kind of sad. Why's the old lady apologizing for every everything? God, it's so slow with slow down time. Uh, 
What do you got? Zora mask? Sticks. I hate you, Grandma. You saved my life! Have some sticks! Children like sticks! I thought it was a baseball bat! Andrew, you still in the kitchen? I know I'm late. I'm not that late. Come on, it's been half an hour. To be fair, she is half an hour late every time. She tells you 11.30, she doesn't get there till midnight. Hey, I'm here. This is your letter? This isn't a letter, this is a tip. Also, you got bugs in your kitchen. How much will he pay for a red potion? Maybe the kitchen is dirty because Andrew's a bad cook. Like, the story is that the place was a restaurant before the father died. And then the- I guess he was their chef because they didn't have anyone to cook the food after that. And now they switched their focus to being an inn. Because, you know, Andrew's a bad cook. Pay me good for it, huh? I'm gonna drink this in front of you. Instead of selling it to you, you rip-off artist. Let's try the mushroom. It's gonna be another 20 rupees. Oh, hey, new item. Thanks. Yeah, that's five rupees. Liars and scam artists, every one of you. All right, old lady, check. Midnight meeting, check. West Clock Town, Curiosity Shop, blue rupee, check. Green rupee. The postman's game. I really hope it's not going to force me to do the archery games. Those are some of the trickiest things to do. Oh, that's right. I, I didn't help them in this timeline. They're still doing their weird, shitty dance moves. You garbage! Your moves will never be worth anything! I could have taught you! I guess still got bug holes I can check. Let's do the gossip stones. We can check the bean grotto if we really want to. Back from horns to nice, quiet, silent drums. You ever consider putting some snares on those or something? This is a little tedious, but it's not that tedious. It's not the frog quest by a mile. Good horse. 
will be waiting for me when I need to enter the Great Bay Area. Fortunately, after the previous randomizer run, I know this game's like heart piece locations to the T, which means the next time I do this, I'm gonna just have everything in this game down pat. I'm gonna have all the heart pieces, all the rupee locations. I did check the fountains, yes. I cleared out all the invisible items in the uh, Termina Field. I've made a point to try to t take care of the easy ones first. Any of the things that could be, uh, you know, low time spent, high reward, and we're just, we've just run out of those. There's a progression item hiding somewhere. I don't like that one. Where are Poe's located in this game? There's a couple of them as enemies in Stone Tower Temple. Are those the only ones? Maybe they appear at, at the... Do they appear in the graveyard at night? I don't think they do, actually. If I could bottle a- well, no, I guess I don't need to bottle a Poe anymore. The reason I thought I did is to get, uh, bottled water. Which could still be useful for the sake of watering plants, but... What's my item? Gossip stones. Normally a heart piece, will it be better? It'll be a magic jar. What else are we doing? Gorman race is something we can do. Slightly less annoying than the archery stuff. Let's go to the bean man. Let's go to the bean grotto. I got bugs, right? A little bit of a trip, but we're gonna have to go at some point, so we might as well. There are two items in there. Dompe's digging game did that. I did all of the grave stuff that I could do without the fire arrows. So I couldn't do the night one grave fully. Where am I going? I'm going to the palace. Them some tough lily pads. Side is the bean man on. I think it's the side.
Why can you hop infinitely? Uh, it's another... It's an option in the randomizer. I turned it on just because it seemed convenient. I have to time the A button presses, so it is skill-based, but... Just lets me move a little bit faster with the Deku. As you know, Deku's speciality is not speed. That's more the guy with the uh, engine legs. Like, I know I'm going... I'm gonna end up going the wrong side. This is the wrong side. This is the heart piece side. You know what? I just, I just remembered something. I have the stone mask. What am I doing? Hello, just a rock. Don't mind me, just a walking rock. Inconspicuous. Out of out of bounds item. Like really? Hello? Have you been here this whole time? What are you? A stray fairy? Oh, okay, land title deed. Well that's unlocks one item. I'd say it unlocks two, but we know one of them is a green rupee. And item number two. They do think I am a rock. It is magical and inconspicuous. I have a bean, right? I do have a bean. I don't need to bother the bean man. I don't need to vi visit my bean daddy. I'm so sorry. In fact, we can use that on our way out of the swamp. Go this way, it's a little bit shorter. Let's reach. There's a piece of Link's hair poking out of the mask. Oh, I'm sure that'll interfere with the mask. Not the rest of Link po poking out. What are you selling? Probably a green rupee for 20 rupees or something stupid like everyone else in this land. Large magic jar for 10 rupees. <sighs> I guess I should get that green rupee. 
just to say that I got it once. Yay. Swamp Scrub Trade. Don't make me do the shooting gallery game. It's gonna make me do it. I could check the boxes just to see what's there. I could be a filthy cheater. I'm, I'm trying very hard to avoid that. I'm going to Great Bay. I'll bet my good horse is still waiting there. What a good horse. This is all contingent on the hope that it does rain here on day two, like it rains most other places. I can go up the waterfall, that's some items I know about. Rain. Rain, damn it! Maybe it's after a certain time it starts raining. I'm st I still am reliant on rain in order to grow my beans. I have no means to bottle water, and I have no means to... I don't have the Song of Storm to, to make it rain myself, so... Ow! If it does rain on day two, I'll have access to two more items out on the, out on the water. If it does not, I'll be able to go out there for at least one more. This is a couple of items. Oh, here we go. This is a big chest. I should have come up here for a stray fairy. Ice arrows! Hey! We can now access Ikana Canyon. That opens up a lot. Well, okay, maybe not a lot, a lot, but it opens up some things. Which I'm just happy for anything opening up at this point. Sweet progress. And there's another big chest over there. How we get to that? Uh, I need a Deku to it. Watch this be the Zora mask. I'm jinxing it by saying anything at all, but... Okay, double defense. Not helpful, but a whole lot better than green rupees. Bay Coast. I got the grotto cows. I forgot to check those. Jargon ledge with tree and without tree chests. 
So there's no point in me going to the top. I can't race the beavers yet without the Zora Mask. Hopefully the Zora Mask is in Ikana Canyon. I'm hoping that the Gorman Brothers or the Shooting Gallery aren't hiding the Zora Mask from me. Obon coming through. Well, since it does not appear to be raining. I'll just go get the, uh, the bug item. Waiting out here. Bomb shop gets a new item after saving the old lady. That's true. I think... I don't remember if I already checked it, though. You know what? I've never saved the old lady, so I guess no, I haven't checked that. Or the uh, all-night mask slot, for that matter. Not that that matters, because I don't have the... I don't have the wallet big enough to buy the all-night mask. Here we go. Here, here's my bean spot. Oh, I used my bugs! I gotta get more bugs! Maybe, maybe the cow grotto has bugs. Actually, I remember where there's bugs. There's bugs right down here. Hello, bugs. You're in a convenient spot. Zora Mask. Sorry, Green Rupee. Give me a Green Rupee. God damn it. Reverse psychology failed. I'm going to go swimming as a Deku child. This is a good idea. Wee Look how free he be. He can go anywhere. He could go to the next continent, if he's good enough. I don't like that. That's a like-like. Also, another pain in the ass item I'm hoping I don't have to do is the lab fish. Because... Due to the bottle randomizer. In order to get a fish, I would have to fight the uh, graveyard Big Poe again. I would have to do the whole Dompe grave thing. So we're going to Ikana. What else do the ice arrows unlock? Anything? Pretty much it. I need the fire arrows for anything at, uh, Snowhead. Oh, bomb shop. Oh, 
I'll also have to remember to check the curiosity shop on day three. For the uh, all night mask. Till 8 a.m., so I can't do the postman's game. It's a blue rupee. Just the big bomb bag. They're selling a blue rupee for 90 rupees. I saved the old lady for this. Oh! I almost forgot, I was doing Honey and Darling this cycle. I gotta do their Day 2 game. Honey and Darling and uh, Curiosity Shop, I gotta check this cycle. Play some basket bomb. The safe, family friendly Terminian pastime. Fun for the whole family. Bring your kids to Bombskitball. Even the name sounds horribly irresponsible. I guess they had the good sense to at least fill the room with water. I wonder how mad they'll get if I bomb them. They kick you out if you shoot them with arrows a few times. I'm worried it would only take one bomb to piss them off, because you really gotta be intentional to bomb them. It's the same as day one. I mean, we knew what that was gonna be. Day three is the, or doing all three days is a new reward. Day three, Honey and Darling, and, uh... Honey and Darling Curiosity Shop. Honey and Darling Curiosity Shop. Yes, yes. We've spoken before, mister. Logically, in, in the land of all of these weird, creepy, messed up people, Link should be the creepiest one of all. Everyone else should be weirded out by Link and how he knows everything they're going to do before they do it. Go. 
That's a shorter climb than I remembered. Okay, it's a fairy. Activate that workstation for when we never get the Song of Soaring. We never will. It's just going to be completely absent this playthrough. Okay. What can we do here? We can't save the father because we don't have the, uh... We don't have the Song of, so of Healing. God, are we going to have to do the Gibdo well? Where do we get a big Poe again? Is it from bottling spring water? We can't make the climb without exploits because we still don't have the Zora mask. We can fight these guys. Gals. Get away! I just want to shoot you! You guys are more annoying than I remember. I'm gonna need another try at this. doing so bad Finally, they're far away. I can get a good shot at them. I gotta not miss is the problem. I should not be using ice arrows. They just take too damn long. not even sure if they deal more damage. I think they do in this game. They didn't in Ocarina, if I remember correctly. Oh no, the cutscene!
and I'm out of arrows. Take the hit. That's fine. She'll come. She'll turn back faster that way. This sucks. But shields are for babies. Nice. No, they don't restock your arrows in this. Tell Jack about this. The angle doesn't help here compared to the Forest Temple fight. Not that she's still at all difficult, but... Okay, heart container. Why does it say Grave 1 Tablet is accessible? Well, I need fire arrows for that. Ikata Canyon Grass, did I get all those? Po Hut, Heart Container. for that Ikana grass. Not a lot of grass around here. There was some around the owl statue. That was probably it.
I have the mirror shield, which should mean I can get into the castle, I believe. Okay, this must be the grass. All rupees. Oh, it's day two, which means I can do the graveyard bats. That's an item. I'll have to climb back up here again, but I don't want to forget. takes those explosions like a champ. He's just mildly stunned. He doesn't even take damage now with the double defense. Dampy, what do you got to say? There are a lot of bats out today. I don't like bats. I wish they'd go away. Actually, ten arrows. The the text was replaced. All right. A two bats, ten arrows. Day one grave tablet. How does it expect me to get through the the room there? You have to light all the chests without fire arrows. Or light all the torches, rather. Oh, I bet there was a torch in the previous room of the Night One Grave. Maybe a slight oversi oversight on my part. Maybe I can't access that. The full Day One Grave. That's still just one item, though. abominations of creatures. Oh, did that not freeze it because I accidentally talked to Tattle? Okay, that's fine. Momentary inconvenience. <laughs> got that, right? Yeah, it's the fairy grass. Also very powerful strain. Sometimes you want some of that Ikana grass, sometimes you want the fairy grass. You've done the area behind the waterfall. I need light arrows in order to access it, so I cannot.
Why you no light? Lightstone, go away. It says I can only access the uh, courtyard grass, which is four items. Oh, because I don't have fire arrows. So I can't melt the ice and go actually up the castle. Magic jar. Rupees. Rupee. Bombs. Got a pot out here. It's just a fairy pot. What do fairies turn into again? Pose? Uh, m mushrooms. So many bottle items that are not easy to get rid of. So there's several bits of grass around here, and four of them are in the pool as non-random items. Great fairy sword. Cool, but not important. We're getting a lot of those kinds of items. Defense upgrade, great fairy sword. We're the ultimate warrior, but we can't get anywhere. Y'all got a Zora's mask? No. Oh, that appears to be all the grass. Great fairy sword, green rupee, five, five bombs, and a magic jar. Let me double check there's nothing we can do in here. Pretty sure we need fire arrows. Yeah, we need fire arrows. It's okay, they can't see you if you don't move. They're like dinosaurs. Alright. Don't believe I can do anything by going down the well in the opposite direction. Oh, I can. Well, hmm. Can I? It says I can access the mirror shield chest. But not from this direction. Boy, if I had the light arrows... So apparently I must be able to access it by going it going the long way. Almost all of the uh almost all the bottom of the well things are red. What does the first guys want? They want beans and a blue potion. Which I found a blue potion. I don't remember where I got it. So in order to do the items in the well, I would need to come back with... The, the issue with the well is that other than the first two items, everything is in the well. However, because I accidentally included bottle items in the scrambler, I'm not guaranteed to get everything I need down there. I could have to make multiple trips in and out of the well, which would be a massive pain without the Song of Soaring. It's a massive pain with the Song of Soaring. Even bigger one without. Also, I have this stupid seahorse still cluttering my inventory. 
If I do the well, it'll be on another cycle when I have all of my bottles free. Dompe grave again for the fish. Think you got it off the bird? No, I got a good item off the bird. It wasn't a blue potion. It was a, it was like an important item. That might have been like the stone mask or something. So what else can we do? A lot of a lot of stuff still closed off in Ikana. Moon. Okay, so here's something I forgot about. There are four pots on the top of the clock tower when you fight Skull Kid. What if the Zora mask has been up there this whole time? That's a thought I fear to entertain. But it's possible. That's four items up there. The big bird was the bomb mask. Okay. Boy, we got all the we got like all the optional items. We just we're not getting the stuff we need. All right, what are we doing? Uh, day three. I could race the Gorman brothers. I guess I should. I should check that. I'll do the Gorman Brothers. I'll do Honey and Darling. I'll do the Curiosity Shop, and I'll do the Moon. That'll be this cycle. I need to summon my horse. I hear my horse. What a good horse. Always waiting. Y'all are making fun of my horse? Have you seen your horses? I don't remember if it was this that Jack and I spent a long time on, or if it was the Epona, the obstacle course. I think it was the obstacle course. I think I remember Wickersham had a lot of trouble with this in our recent playthrough of, of Vanilla Majora's Mask, though. Wicker? It's easy as pie. Couldn't be easier. I don't know why there was so problems. There was problems for you. Stray fairy. What do you sell again? I think I already checked what item they sell. Yeah, it was a large magic jar. I have it checked off. Alright. Honey and Darling. Curiosity Shop. Moon.
Did I get all the bug holes or did I miss some? I'll have to do a once over again. Probably still one or two I didn't get. Potion. Zora Cape Waterfall Pot. Oh, okay. That's that's easy to get. I can get a blue potion. Blue potion and beans are not going to be a problem. Even getting access to any of the temples would be nice, because that's a lot of a ton of items are hiding in temples. We're just missing one item we need for any of the temples. <laughs> All right, easiest game, maybe. I don't know. Bomb basket is pretty easy. Easiest game. Well, I don't understand why you had any problems with it. Easier than shooting womp rats back home. Imagine the extremely southern Luke Skywalker. Well, I don't know much about no Death Stars. I'm just a little, I'm just a farm boy. I guess that wouldn't substantially change the series. Alright, what do you got? Okay, that's a progression item. That actually is the perfect time for us to get that. Now we can actually buy whatever's in the curiosity shop if we need it. Oh, I don't know nothing about my sister, but I know Lay is pretty pretty. Space Alabama. Oh, it's it's Space Kansas. It's Tatooine. I know this because Gavin explained to me the Star War. That last note lasts for so long. Alright, East Clock Town, Honey and Darling, three day reward. There's Madame Aroma in the bar that we can technically access. I think. We buy the priority mail to Mama from the Swamp Hag shop, if I remember correctly. There's little inconvenient items scattered around that I've been avoiding, is what is... We're down to that and the well. Neither of which are great choices. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Big fat hen. Uh. <laughs> you know what? It's not a progression item, but I got I got nothing to spend rupees on. Rupees are worthless now.
I might as well. There's also the in guest room chest that I didn't check. Where was the room key? The room key was in a snowball on the path to Snowhead. That's something I could do. That's something I could do now. I just forgot to, to use it when I had it. I think. I just, I can't remember. Maybe I, maybe I did remember to use the room key. Once again, I'm also all scrambled up because I'm re-watching Vinny's Majora randomizer. And I'm remembering his locations for things. I think I've already gotten it too, but I, I might as well check. I'll slow down time. I'll make a quick run to the mountains. We're not in a hurry. The world's not ending. Why these snowballs don't change from day to day? Low road traffic? Link to Smash. Make him the fastest and heaviest super heavy. I don't already have it, do I? No. Did I miss a snowball? Oh, path to Snowhead, not path to Mountain Village. It's out here. Oh, it's a, it's a little ways out. Song of Soaring. This would be a warp here, a warp back, and that would be all it was. But it's not. We decided not to include a fast travel system in our video game because we wanted the player to feel immersed. And fast travel isn't realistic. There you are. I also missed nighttime music. I should have enabled it. thematically appropriate for there not to be music at night, but it's, it's kind of it's boring for half the game.
I wonder statistically how much time you spend at night in this game during a playthrough. Presumably less than during the day because you start during the day. So you're guaranteed to have at least a full day cycle every time you do anything. All right, north. East Clock Town for the inn. Good horse. They're really good about keeping this this room and only this room locked. Pretty sure I already got this chest as well. Chess. Stray fairy? God damn it. In room guest chest. Zora mask. I could have gotten this at any time. I just, I forgot to use the room key. It was as simple as that. Let's go to the moon. It really is like forgetting you had an inn reservation, and then boom, you wasted 200 bucks. Don't mind me, Skull Kid. I'm just here to get stuff. Like rupees. Boy, you sure got a lot of rupees up here. You got green rupees, you got blue rupees, you got more green rupees. You even got a purple rupee. Have one for the road. You're kind of a jerk. That was a big item. That was the, probably the biggest item that we were still missing. However, it's still not all we need. We still need the, uh... We still need the Zora Song to access the temple. We need the Fire Arrows to finish Snowhead Temple, and we need the Deku Song for that temple. We can... Now we need the light arrows to do... We can't do any of the temples. We're missing at least one item for all of them still. But a bunch of things just opened up. So, we can get those items much more likely now, much more easily. Let's start by doing the, the stockpot in mask thing that we can apparently only do as a Zora. What appropriate music. We had to do the mask thing, uh... We gotta get our, our, our green rupee from uh, the treasure chest game shop. If this ends up being like a 15 hour run, that'll be about on par with our last randomizer run, which considering how crazy this one is, is progress.
What was that nonsense I just had to do? There's no way they intended that. For two magic jars and a green rupee. Well, you know what? It We didn't have to do the archery. We also didn't actually have to race the Gorman brothers, but we did it anyway. It says we can do the entire Anju and Kafe quest if we wanted to. We're not going to. Good God, we're not going to, but we could. There's still the Postman's game, the Biobaba. Bio it's like Bio Broly, but instead they cloned a uh, fortune teller Baba. Let's go check her out. We can finally do the Bio Baba Grotto. That we found very early on, but we couldn't do anything with because we needed Zora. Get some supplies while we're at it. Wait, I saw it. Where is it? I'm not. Well, no, I can get the seahorse this time. can get into Lulu's room now. I can do a bunch of stuff at Zora Hall. Maybe I won't have to do the bottom of the well at all. That'll be great. I still don't have the Lens of Truth, so the Red Potion is useless. That's what I want. Let I, a Deku child, drink alcohol. It's a nice way to stock up at the start of a run. Just just follow the bird. What a convenient bird to know about. Although in the base game, I think he just drops rupees. Oh no, wait, I needed to I'm not taking a pony. I'm getting getting this rock right here. Oh, the underwater chest, that's right. Dive, please. It was a rupee. Oh, is that it? Isn't there an item down here? There should be two items. I believe there's a heart piece down in the water, and one of the hives should also have something in it. Maybe that was it. It was just they were both rupees. Yep, red rupee and green rupee. Quiet in here. I can do the 
pot game. Although it said I could do that before. I don't know why it said that. Skultula. I got the worst instruments in this run. It's thematically appropriate. It's water drops. You can't hear any of them except for the bells, though. The bells are cool. I like the bell ocarina. Zora eggs will have to be still Zora eggs. Because there's exactly seven of them. They couldn't be replaced with another thing to be bottled. Maybe they could, in theory be a pain in the ass, but it could be possible in theory. It's super effective. Okay, giant's mask. I'll take it. That ain't bad. Woodfall Temple. Get out of here, bonefish. I'm, I'm scrolling through my list. Snowhead Milker, almost everything is checked. We've done so many things in this game. It's a fisherman pictograph. I still cannot help Macau despite being Macau, because I don't have the Song of Healing. Zora Cape like like. Zora Cape underwater chest. There is one of those, isn't there? The Beaver Race has two items. Stay here for a while, Epona. Enjoy the scenery. You're on vacation. Swim in the, we'll, we'll swim in the shallows. That's what we'll do. Underwater chest. Where are you? I can see you on the map, in fact. There's a bunch of stuff in the Pirate's Fortress. Bundle of arrows. I need to check where I got the, uh... The Mountain Title Deed. I don't remember where that was. I think it was for sale in a shop, actually.
Large magic jar. Great, thanks. Used to be a hundred rupees, now it's a, a magic jar. Get up there, Link. A slightly annoying climb. Gotta use that hook shot. you again. Oh, that was the Ice Arrows chest. Graph of Lulu slots, but I was never able to get the uh, the bad pictograph of Lulu option. Now this is a convenience thing. There's a setting so you only have to race the beavers once instead of twice. So this should, in theory, give us both items. Welcome back to Termina Country Radio. Your only choice of music for all your minigame needs. Japanese games really need to stop calling these races. Because you're not racing. Your goal isn't to get there before the beaver. It's just to get through all the rings. It's kind of a different thing. Fortunately, there aren't, like, a bunch of pots or anything layered along this racetrack here. Otherwise, like the Goron race, which is, in fact, a race. There could be a bunch of item slots in here. Come to think of it, I wonder if all of Goat's magic pots are replaced. They seem to have replaced all of the magic pots in the game. Great, thanks. Oh, it's supposed to be two items. Beaver race one, green rupee. Do I still have to do it twice? Maybe, okay, if I remember correctly, you have to race both the little brother and the big brother for the bottle. And then you have to do both of them again for the heart piece? So it's really not that you only have to race the beavers once, you have to 
race them twice instead of four times. Or three times? I'd still rather just do the hardest one once, to be honest. Honestly, getting up here is more of a pain than the race itself. I think. I think that the swimming controls in this game are very fluid. Jack seemed to struggle with them. We'll never know Wickersham's opinion because he never did the beaver races. That didn't count? I think it didn't count because I was using my magic shield or something. Oh, a second green rupee. You're so generous. I don't know why I expected beavers to have anything of value. They're fucking beavers. Rupee jar game. Zora Cape underwater chest. Got that. That's all we can do at Zora Cape. Mountain. Title deed. Ocean Sculptula Colored Skulls Pot. Okay. That's nearby. We can do that. We can nab that real quick. Oh, the cool sound effect. God damn, now I got country radio minigame music stuck in my head. Man, I went through so much effort to de-infest this place. I just come back and it's right back to the way it was. Kind of depressing. Alright. It's in a pot. Oh, I still have the thing on! Thank you! These stairs are way too steep to be OSHA.
Let's go to Pinnacle Rock. Let's get rid- let's offload our seahorse. Then we can go to Zora Hall. Surprise there's not more underwater stuff. You'd think there'd be a bunch, like things we could bust open underwater as a Zora, but no. swim to follow the seahorse instead of just walking. Two chests, some Zora eggs, which I assume are still Zora eggs. Alternatively, the Zora eggs could be, what, pose? I would have to go to Stone Tower Temple and defeat seven of the Poe enemies in order to have enough eggs for this quest. Nope, it's just Zora eggs or Zora eggs. That's probably for the best. Are all these pots things? Those two weren't. I'm gonna do the entire, like, Zora Egg quest just to get a green rupee, aren't I? I really just wanted to confirm that Zora eggs were still Zora eggs and not something else I might need to bottle. It's a small chest. It says the pots are randomized. There's just been nothing good in them. check. Oh no, I bet those are the pots, the four in the bottom center.
Alright, let's check these pots. Green Rupee. Green Rupee. And, let me guess. Green Rupee. Maybe, maybe these aren't the randomized chests. Randomized pots. That one was a blue rupee. It might have been the ones that were in the paths. Which were also just junk items. It, it really just says they're all... It's three green rupees and a blue rupee. Thank you, Wink. Have a green rupee! This is just, This is sad at this point. Yeah, thanks, red rupee. I mean, I knew what I was getting into, but still. Man, it hurts sometimes. Quick visit to Zora Hall. We'll check out the fortress. I think I will end the stream after dropping the uh, Zora eggs. I've already got three of them. I might as well do the other ones. I don't trust this guy. I don't trust this music. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in the fortress. It says it's all accessible, too. Fortress will be our final hoorah of the stream. Oh man, I hope I don't get like a bottle item that's gonna fill up my inventory. Because I need all my I need all of my bottles for the last four eggs. This like bike isn't anything special, is he? Right down here. Just gonna drop plain old rupees. Yeah. Oh, I should have kept an egg for Evan. Now he just he doesn't do anything special with the eggs. Eggs. He just he just tells you what to do with them. Anything in here? 
scrub purchase. Uh, so the Zora Mask was in the inn in town. Which I've had access to for a while, and I just forgot to check. I could have gotten it at any time. Hello, stranger. Check out this song I wrote on my bells. This is an original Wink production. Make sure to credit the song to Butthole Wink. That's my stage name. It's probably about how much Mike Love would pay for song rights. Here's five bucks, kid. I wrote that. What are you selling, Mr. Scrub? I see a map up there, I think. Ten Deku Nuts. Nope. Looking to move to the mountains? I got you covered. With Wink Realty. Sir, that's not the price we agreed upon. Sir, don't leave. You can't give me one green rupee and leave with my title deed. Alright, dungeon map. idea rolling around Zora Zora's domain Zora Cape Zora Hall that's the one that's Goron I'm gonna do it anyway because it's fast Let's take a quick pictograph consent not required that his shorts are white make make him look naked. I have a picture, you weirdo. Oh! Wow! This guy was holding out! I think that was a good pictograph? What's a bad pictograph of Lulu? Maybe if I take it as a different form? Maybe she won't be as happy if I'm not Mikau. Just get like, I don't know, her feet. Let's give this guy Lulu feet pics. There's two slots, one for a good Lulu picture and a bad Lulu picture. 
He wants the good picture, but he needs the bad picture. But it is Lulu. Look, I brought you a feet pick. He doesn't want it. is. He's a tits man. I'm sorry. I don't know what a bad Lulu pick is. He said he liked her face, so I'm assuming if her face is in it, then that's a good picture. Maybe one from far away. I could just click the box to see what the reward is, but that's not in the spirit of things. Still, the Fierce Deity Mask is great. I'm, I'm glad I catered to this perv. Unlike me, who is incredibly chaste, I'm a good Christian boy. Alright, let, let's go to the Pirate's Fortress to finish things off. The power of milk magic. Summon my white energy shield. For I am Wink. Master of white magic. Where am I? I can't see with this stupid shield up. Everything's dark. Logically, nighttime is the best time to, to raid the pirate's fortress. They should all be asleep, right? I can't help you! I think having the Goron and, and Zora mask in the previous version of the randomizer broke it. Like, you could no longer help Darmani or Mikau once you had them. They wouldn't spawn anymore. Which probably meant the logic had to be sure not to include any important items in uh, whatever they give you. They seem to have addressed that now. What's the music? Uh-oh! Okay, we're good. A little worried. Is this the Great Bay Temple music? It is. Well, you know what? It actually fits here. Maybe not the pounding iron, but... the general melody. That works. All right, there are three chests just in this outside area. All gonna be green rupees. Calling it now. 
Darn, I hate it when I'm wrong. How dare you defy me, game? It would be so terrible if you th included things that weren't green rupees in the other two chests. Man, I would hate that. You got me by the balls, game. Man, I am having the worst time. Okay, two out of three is not bad. None of them were green rupees. need to get a pictograph of one. And everyone with a libido in this game is, is uh, clustered here in the Great Bay area. All the sexy people come to the beach. I realize I've not shown off Goron Link's beautiful face in this playthrough. I, I have to do this. There he be. Look at our boy. Look how beautiful and cute he is. I wish I could use this stupid shield without being blind. It darkens everything. But there's bonefish everywhere, so I kind of have to. All right, cages, pots, barrels. Oh, all the barrels in the in the in the maze room are going to be different things. That's that's a lot of things. Don't disappoint me. We're gonna have a great time at the Pirate's Fortress. We're gonna get so many items. We're gonna rob these pirates blind. chest. Green rupee. Thanks, game. You really got my back. Keep the green rupees coming. Anything behind me. I gotta be third. There could be, like, little pots or something anywhere. chest. Cage room shallow chest. Oh, it's a, that's a pretty cool prison. You got, you got one a green rupee locked up in there. What are the barrels outside got? Nothing. Nothing. And a blue rupee. down here. Deep chest. Yeah, 
is arrows. Disappointing romp through the pirate's fortress so far. I still got hope. Maybe Gorons have better luck. Maybe that's a stat. Blue rupee. Sorry, red rupee. Nothing, nothing, and nothing. Nothing. A lot of nothing in these barrels. And a rupee. Uh oh! Went right into the water. We got these barrels, didn't we? Nothing, nothing, milk. Quite a few instances of milk around, since it replaced all of the uh, cow milkings. All right, green rupee. And what are the pots? Nothing. And a magic jar. Is that really everything in this room? Cage, cage pot, five barrels. They're all just rupees and milk. Probably don't even hurt me that much. Do like a quarter heart of damage, if that. Majora's Mask Link is a tank, even without the double defense upgrade. Oh, that didn't count. bad. Alright, here's some pots. I'm gonna move you so you're not so close to that ledge. Hearts, magic jar... Barrels with nuts. Green, uh, blue rupee. Magic jar and more milk. Oh, we just found the Gerudo milk storage. That sounded kind of bad saying it out loud.
Sewer exit barrel one, two, three, pot one and two. Fortress sewer gate pot. Then around here. Pretty sure I broke everything. Well, wherever it was, it was a blue rupee. Go ahead and drink my milk. Seems like a good time. Build up all of my magical energies for the challenge ahead of me. Winky, a big boy. You need two gallons of milk. There we go. There's my, there's my game-breaking stone mask. All right, what's here? Bookshot chest, room pot, uh, pirate's fortress item one, two, and three. Oh, where are those at? Aren't those? I I think I know where those are, but they're in an area that's either just like really hard to get to. me, I'm just a rock. Oh, it tells you whether a picture is good or not when you take it. That's great! That's a great quality of life feature for the randomizer. I guess those crates never contain anything. They're just there to be crates. Okay, bye-bye, Tox. I'm not going to be going too much longer. I just, I just want to clean out these pirate ladies of their nice belongings. Out of the way. You know, in as gentlemanly a fashion as possible. I'm like Sly Cooper. I'm, I'm a gentleman thief. Okay, heart piece and green rupee. man who stole the world. Hey, I got a green rupee to sell you. That is weird that... Oh, because it's Ocarina Link. His hair tuft is a little bit more pronounced. That's why it sticks out of the uh, stone mask. This isn't the Majora model. This is the Ocarina model. chest is a stray fairy bookshot room skull flag forehead that's stupid you're stupid game I assume the pots were the ones that I broke up in the up in the rafters there two pots listed in this room. I've still got this... I don't need this camera out. Pots. Skull flag forehead. Oh. 
I'm gonna remember how to get to those uh, rupees. I might need the Scarecrow song, which I hope is between cycles. I hope I don't have to play it every single cycle. Hello. <laughs> know what I should get out? Yeah. Bitchin'. One hit. It didn't show it, but I basically just bisected her. This is where I just was. One more. One for the road. item slots. Even with the ones dedicated to the masks and ocarina, it's not enough. I need a whole Minecraft inventory. egg pot. Interior tank chest. I assume that's what I just got. Bone guard egg pot. I don't know what any of these things are describing. I might have to check the, the guide with the pictures. Some stuff down there. The question is how I get down there. I think that mu I think that's a scarecrow song thing. You know what? I'm gonna check before I go further. While I'm up here, Pirates Fortress item one, two, and three. There's stuff right below me, but they make it. They really make sure you can't just jump over the fence and get down there. Pirate Fortress Interior. Can be done without items. Well, how do you get down there, though? See, there's invisible walls. They really make a point to prevent you from getting down to those items. Uh, what's the problem, man? Just go pick them up. It's easy. 
There's a fence here, so I can't make a diagonal jump. I can, but it'd be real... It'll, it'll be tight. Okay, it's not that tight. It's just a heart piece. Two green rupees and a heart piece. they look at you like through their eyes you're just a rock floating by inconspicuously hello don't mind me just a rock stealing your stuff interior guard room chest in here? No? I got cannons. to be pretty reckless since she's dealing like no damage to me. If she hits me once with that big attack, it, it just ends regardless, though. Magic jar. Arts. Nothing. Every time we do this, we end up doing most of the game regardless of what the settings are. One day we'll get an absurdly lucky randomizer seed, and we'll just breeze through everything the first time. We'll get all the important items immediately. We'll be able to skip entire chunks of the game. We won't get green rupees everywhere. Gotta do it in the same cycle? But maybe not. No, it's on the other side of this. How do I get over there? Through this room? I assume this is the barrel maze room. Yeah. 
Screw it. I don't need no battle tactics. I just need stabby stabby go down. Alright. Pot one and pot two. Hearts. Blue rupee. Green rupee. Oh, that's right, he's got a hat on. I completely forgot his head wasn't normally just long and fully white. thought that was everything, but there's one more thing we must be able to get up to. There's a, there's a treasure chest we can see on the map. There must be a way to get up to it. Aha! What are you? A red rupee. Well, I believe that's everything in the pirate's fortress. Wait, no, we got the three standalone items. We got all the pots and things. Skull flag left eye and right eye. I assume that's this skull flag. doesn't mention a specific room. A specific room. And this is the big one. Arrows, green rupee, green rupee. What about lefty? Berry. Milk. And arrows. Okay, nothing great. We actually didn't... We found almost nothing in the Pirate's Fortress. There were like 30 item slots and we got nothing significant out of any of them. Just some heart pieces, some stray fairies, and that's it. Allow me to breach the water. Front of a of a front of a pirate. I want her to notice me. Notice me, senpai. Was it cool looking though? Look before you throw me out. She wasn't impressed. I thought maybe I'd check out the female pirates, man. So it's, it's all the it's all the the heat in the water. You know you know how the the chemicals in the river make the frogs gay. Well, the, the chemicals in Great Bay make all the Zoras horny. That's what's going on here. I'll bet this place had a nice tourism. I'll bet it had a nice tourism. Before, uh, I, I guess this started happening and all the fish went away. You'd think warm water would be great for tourism. Oh. Oh, I can see what he gives me. He's just got a magic jar. I already have the pictograph, so...
I thought maybe it was like the magic bar upgrade and it just looked like a magic jar, but no, it is in fact just a small magic jar. Oh yeah, like I said, I will... Thanks to this run, thanks to the previous run, I now know, like, all the heart pieces and rupee chests and little item locations to a T. And next time, I'll know all the, the stupid BS things that you can shoot for rupee drops in the game. I'm, I'm set for next year. Maybe I can get Jack to play the all rupee randomizer and tear his hair out in 2022. Alright, last item. The, the stupid Zora eggs. We got the Fierce Deity Mask. We got the Zora Mask this stream. We got a lot of good stuff. We just still can't do any temples. We'll have to spend... Uh, we'll have to start the next stream. Wow, I almost went five hours today. We'll have to start the next stream looking for, uh, the songs and more of the arrows. Some, enough to access any of the temples. We're so close, and yet so far. Might have to check out the bottom of the well next time. do a race combine the frustration. Someone suggested doing a race of this with me. Not the all rupee one, but just a randomizer race. I might end up doing that next year, but uh, I didn't do it because I wanted to do the all rupee thing. And I kind of wanted to do it, you know, at my own pace. If I'm doing a race, I don't really get to appreciate the game. Because I'm just looking for the fastest way to the end of everything. Unlike this, like, look at all the appreciating I'm doing. I've spent, like, 15 hours of this playthrough appreciating. It's milk. I stole this from the pirates when they weren't looking. Bottoms up! I've earned this. He truly does gain his power from milk. Well, okay. I guess that's that. That That's our, uh... That, that was our reward. Get my stuff out, we'll go back in time. be that. Wave bye-bye, mil- uh, wink. Well, this was quite a stream. Five. Five hours. I didn't realize I'd been going that long. I had fun, though. I, I am still enjoying this, despite the incredible abundance of green rupees, magic jars, and milk. We're making progress. Very, very slowly. We got the Zora Mask. We found it in the inn. Uh, we'll see. I'll probably do the, more of this, more Frogger, more something solo throughout the week. Jack will be available again on Saturday. We'll see if we can stream something. Thanks for watching today, and I'll see you next time I stream.